The next circuit we look at is a majority function. This one is over three variables. The idea here is if the majority of the input, a, b, and c, are one, the output will be one. If it's a minority, the output will be zero. The majority cases are 0, 1, 1, 1, 0, 1, 1, 1, 0, and 1, 1, 1. If any of those occur, we want this to go to 1. The first of them is 0, 1, 1. And here we have a 0, b 1, and c 1. And that causes this AND to fire, because this AND receives three inputs. The first of them is the inverted form of a, which is 1, because a is 0. And the other two are b, which is 1, and c, which is a 1. So that's the case that handles 0, 1, 1. In that case, we have a is off, b is on, c is on. And we fire, and we go through the or, and we get a 1 at the output. The next case here would be uh, 1, 0, 1. So we go to this here. 1, 0, 1 is handled by this AND. It looks like a complicated circuit, but it's relatively simple. You, these, are, these are where the action happens, these ANDs. All of this wiring is just... Um, confusing, but it's relatively simple. In the case of this, we want the uh, we want to handle the situation where b is zero, and you can see um, and you can see the input here from b is zero, but it goes through the inverter and it comes in here as one. So we have a one coming from b, even though it's zero, of course. And we have direct input from A, which is a 1, and direct input from C, which is a 1. So since C is 1, a is 1, b is 0, but that's inverted, this one will fire and we indeed get the 1 at the output. The next case here is 1, 1, 0. And in that case, this, this AND fires because it gets the 1 from the A, it gets the 1 from the B, you follow up here, uh, and the C is the inverted form of C, C being 0, that inverts to 1, so this handles the case of 1, 1, 0. The final case is 1, 1, 1 where they're all on, and that's handled down here. Now in this case, it takes the uninverted input of all three, and we get the output of one. So although a circuit like this, as I said, looks very complicated, the real action is in these ands, and we could increase it. We could um, go to four, five, six. Of course, now the wiring will get even more complicated, but this does tell us when a majority of the, one, of the input is one.